At times, people can be so heartless. Just have a look at this joke. What's up everybody? Zimmer's right here on the Zimax Media and welcome to the Flight Info. Today we are having some cool breeze outside here and welcome to another video. Last time I say I'll be coming with more information on airlines. So today I'm talking about airlines. Airlines. All about airlines and destinations. Disclaimer. Yeah, today I'll be a bit Quick, please bear with my speed because I'll be covering a number of airlines, Ethiopian Airlines, Emirates, Qatar, also Kenya Airways on the list today here. Yeah, so there's a lot of information on airlines like Qatar Airways updating their destinations all over the world in Africa, Middle East. So it's good for you to know where these airlines are flying to and the new destination. So I'll begin with Qatar Airways. Where are they flying to? You can't believe this, Qatar Airways are flying to Somalia, three weekly flights to Somalia. And I will quote for you. We are pleased to announce the resumption of three weekly flights to Mogadishu, Somalia from today. That was 6th of September, that was yesterday I mean. Yeah, 6th of September 2020. So, Qatar flying to Somalia, you can consider booking flights. And remember, Kenya Airways is not flying to Somalia. So, this is a good move by the Qatar Airways. Our next airline is Ethiopian Airlines to update flights to Tanzania and Namibia and I will quote it for you right here. Ethiopia is set to start its freighter service to Mwanza, Tanzania as of September 9th, 2020. So this cargo service uh, by Ethiopian Airlines to Mwanza. If you have your goods you have to take to Mwanza, Tanzania, yeah you can book it here. And number two, we have resumed our passenger flights, these passenger flights, to Windhoek, Namibia, effective September 11th, 2020. So my guys from the southern part of Africa, good stuff here from the, from the ET. Yeah, you can book your flights to Windhoek, 11th of September onwards. Well, that's about it for Ethiopian Airlines. And uh, as I said earlier, I will be a bit quick today. So next airline is Emirates. Some good stuff here by the Emirates Airlines. Yeah, flying to Nigeria, flying to to Ghana, to Ivory Coast. So let me just quote for you as we move forward quick. Emirates will resume passenger flights to Lagos 7th of September, that is today, Monday, and Abuja on 9th of September in Nigeria, taking its global uh, networks to 84 destinations, including 13 cities in Africa. So my guys from Nigeria, some good stuff here by the Emirates Airlines. You can book your flights maybe from Dubai to Nigeria, but there is something here. Nigeria was supposed to resume their flights last week on 29th of August, but there is a report that came in. They have extended that resumption to some other date, maybe next week, and I will give those updates in a few. And number two, by the Emirates Airlines, that uh, they will be resuming their flights to Jordan, Amman. That's tomorrow, 8th of September. They will quote, Emirates will resume daily passenger services to Amman from 8th of September. The Jordanian capital will be the eighth destination in the Middle East to be served by Emirates. Such a good thing. If you wish to fly there, please consider booking Emirates Airlines. The number three is still on Emirates. They're also flying to Ghana and Ivory Coast. Let me just quote for you right here. This was uh, done on 1st of September update. Emirates Global Passengers Destination Network reaches at one cities with the resumption of three weekly linked services from Dubai to Accra, Ghana and Abidjan Ivory Coast from 6th of September. We'll return to Conakry, Dakar, Lusaka and Warsaw this week, taking our global passenger destination to 79 cities. Okay, it just began raining and I'm doing this thing outside, so let me just be quick before I get a downpour here. Now, number four on Emirates. Uh, resuming their flights to Lusaka, Zambia, and I'll quote it for you here. Emirates will resume twice weekly passenger service to Lusaka, Zambia from 4th of September. Those are three days ago, widening its reach in Africa to nine destinations. So this was uh, three days ago, like some four days ago. So they resumed their flights to Zambia on the 4th of September. So my guys from the 
southern part of Africa, Zambia. Yeah, Emirates is doing well. It's doing fine. Let me finish with uh, this round air, though I had also something on the Kenya Airways and uh, Saudi Arabia. Let me just finish up with round air. Round air. We are happy to announce that we are resuming our service to Lagos and Abuja starting from 14th of September 2020. Lagos and Abuja, that's by round air. But and there is something here. There's news of some airlines that have been banned from going to Nigeria. So this one air I think was among them. But I'll give you that list because there are some airlines that have been banned to go to Nigeria. Banned by the government of Nigeria. So I'll be giving those updates. Yeah, you can check out the status of our destinations and medical requirements here on the Rwanda Air. Yeah, I believe that's all we had for today as uh, updates. Not really lots of stuff, but uh, just something small here and there to kick us off for the week. It's a chilly Monday, but thanks for tuning in, man. We are always glad to be here with you, just giving these updates. And Kamakawaida, if there is any quiz, any query, any question, just drop it down there. Just down there, the comment section. And our very able team and crew at the ZMAX Media Flight Info will always be there to respond to each and every one. We try as much as possible to respond to everyone's quiz, giving credible information. So guys, thanks for tuning in. I'm your guy, Mzima Wells, and I'll be back with more stuff. Stay tuned and keep it locked. Peace out.